Hello, everyone. Can you hear me okay? Hello, hello. The Irish won the space race. We did. We played the long con. You know, like, other countries might have got to the moon first. We're the ones who take it. That's how we plan to rule the world, honestly. <laughs> Jump scare. <laughs> like, hey guys! Can you hear me okay? Jesus Christ! <laughs> no, but hello everyone. How y'all doing? Quick old audio check just to make sure we're coming out okay. Hope everyone's doing good. I hope y'all enjoyed your pizza. Uh, over the weekend. Uh, the cleanup. You'd be pleased to know, took like two hours after the fact with like two people. Uh, it was atrocious. There was... <laughs> there was flour fucking everywhere all over the floor. <laughs> It took so damn long to clean. Uh, but we got there. Ah, uh, the kitchen is clean again. Uh, and now we're destroying the International Space Station, which just seems to be the logical progression, uh, of things. Uh, we are checking out a game that we've been very kindly sponsored to play tonight. It is called Hard Space Shipbreaker. Uh, basically, you're a demolition man, but in space. Uh, I don't really know anything about it. Game kind of just sounded intriguing. I was like, sure, fuck it. Let's give it a go. So, if you enjoy what you see on this stream, if you type exclamation point space, there's a link to it in the description. We're just going to be checking it out as we go. Game is actually so damn good. Yeah, it, it just sounds interesting from the premise, I'll be honest with you. So I thought, you know, just give it a go. Why not? I, I, I mean, at the very least, we get to, like... Jeopardize, <laughs> I was about to say jeopardize some astronauts' lives as if that's a good thing. And yeah, we get to terrorize some people, so you know, at the very least, at the very least of something there. Um, no, I mean, I mean it, it should be fun. The premise sounds interesting enough. Uh, we're just going to kind of go into it. And depending on how we do on time today, uh, this may be a twofer. Because there is another game I want to try and squeeze in if I've got time later. Uh, and the, uh, it, it just depends on time and how we're doing. Because uh, as a big heads up, uh, this is the last stream of the week. Happy Tuesday. Uh, until Sunday. Uh, I am going to be in London the next few days. I am hopping over uh, for a top secret project that I can't talk about yet. But also for EGX. Uh, which is happening this weekend. Uh, I'm gonna be at the con. Uh, I'm gonna be there with Spiff. I'm gonna be there with Kiwo. I'm gonna be there with Kelly. I'm gonna be there with, uh, with uh, Ash. Should be a good time. We're all we're doing like a big group meet and greet, and we just kind of want to hang out and have it space. Uh, it should be a good time. If you happen to be in London, if you happen to want to come say hey, uh, if you check our twitters, we all posted out a thing with our times. It should be good crack. It's it's our usual gang of friends that we always hang out with. Dan, no, you can't become the new queen. <laughs> it's my turn to rule now. They used to call me the Drift King back in college, right? I have more qualifications than most folks. Let's be real here. Long live the Dan. Uh, Tim, thank you for the five gift subs uh, just there as well. Thank you very much. Thank you to everyone who subbed in general there. Thank you all for the bits. Yeah, I, I can actually catch up with chat this time as well compared to like the setup we had uh, on Sunday stream. Like, I, I hope people understand that. It's just like the stream setup like was on fire as is and it was just kind of hard to see everything. I, I really do appreciate it though when people still support me. You know, if I'm not always able to respond on that. Like, you know, it it's very kind of you. Really am thankful for you. Don't let your dreams become memes. We were screaming into the void. I love the fact that, like, it's now established that Twitch has, like, object permeance issues. It, 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 it does explain a lot, like, especially whenever I disappear. Like, there's, like, a panic in chat where it's like, Oh God, he's dead. <laughs> If I stop talking for like two minutes, it's like, no, he's gone. He's gone. Sometimes I can still hear his voice. Can you wish me a happy birthday, please, Dad? Happy birthday to you. I hope you're having a good one. Attachment issues. We never grew up from infanthood. 
Ah, oh, Jesus. Free Northern Ireland from the UK. Honestly, at this rate, they might free themselves. <laughs> like, Jesus. Oh, God. Star Trek predicted it happens in 2024, right? So, honestly, I think we just kind of sit and wait a while. Just see what happens. Ah, oh, dear. But, yeah, we're gonna... That's... Let's dive on into some games. Oh, I have to play this clip. Hang on. Oh, I love this sound file. Hang on. <laughs> I'm escaping to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space! <laughs> I love that clip. I love that clip so much. Thank you. Thank you for linking that. <laughs> it's just it's just the way he says space. It's quite ironic considering we actually have been sponsored this stream, so I don't think Tim Curry's doing too well. We found them, it's caught up. <laughs> it's quite ironic. Oh Jesus. It's delivery on space. It's so good. Wait, that's the wrong scene. Hang on. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's dive on into this. We're going to play this for at least a few hours. Uh, open shift, removed shift timer, and oxygen drain for more relaxed experience. Honestly, I kind of just want to fuck about. I know this is probably like, like Babby's easy mode, but I kind of want to do that just so I can mess about with the ship. Unlimited lies, but you work on the clock. Time is money. I kind of, I kind of just want to go into space. Yep. Open shift mode allows players to play at their own pace. Please select the, below if you prefer to use standard oxygen drain, or if you would prefer oxygen drain disabled. Oxygen will still leak if you crack your helmet. Um. Yeah, if I crack my helmet, yeah, I, I, I can keep that on. I can keep that on. That's fine. We'll enable that, but go open shift. So I, I just want to fuck about in space. Honestly. Or as Tim Curry puts it. Space! Humankind has industrialized much of the solar system. Earth has deteriorated into a place of squalor and decay. In orbit, a new breed of worker has emerged. The Shipbreaker. The labor is extremely dangerous. But for a select few, hazard pay is worth the risk. I mean, it does. It does seem like a rough job. Like, don't fall into the like the atmosphere. You're gonna burn up. New green contamination concern. What's going on here? We got some funky. Oh, okay. Hang on. It, is that kind of loud for anyone else? Do I need to turn on the audio? Yeah. Let me set it there. Let me set it there. That's fine. Okay. Man. Oh, my headphone is now falling off my headset. I, I I need to get some like duct tape or something to like patch that together. Okay. It ain't loud. It's a little quiet. I can turn it up for you. How's that? A paved way to the galaxy program. Updating your application status. Reason Citizen LF. Congratulations. You've been accepted into Lynx Corporation's uh, pioneer and paved the way to the Galaxy program. Selection was based on ab above average physical and cognitive ability. I'll be honest, first thing that jumps to mind, um, I don't know. I, I, uh, I know that you, like, in America, you guys have Axe Body Spray, but for some reason, they call that Lynx here. That's immediately what I think of when I just see that. Like, you did it, Lynx. They've made it in the world. Uh, you were assigned to Salvage Station 42. Uh, designation Morig Morrigan? Demonstrate the ability to build and grow a profitable operation, and a number of exciting opportunities await you. Remember, employment in this program is at the sole discretion of Lynx Corporation and can be revoked at any time. Acts of malice or insubordination will not be tolerated. Upon signing this form, pr please proceed immediately to the nearest Lynx Corporation shuttle hub to transport to the worksite. Finalize the following pages to confirm employment. 
Oh my, I've got like actual like terms and conditions here. Um, I gotta enter my name here. I'm actually playing this on PS5, in case people are wondering. I'm not playing it. It's a bit cozy. I'm not playing it on PC this time, I'm playing it on PS5. Uh What do we what do we want to call him? Going into space. No, we can't have, we have to save Jaris Bonson for the Pokemon Scarlet and Violet playthrough. I, I fucking love Jaris Bonson, but we're gonna we're gonna have that character later. <laughs> what do we wanna call? It's just Tim Curry. <laughs> I don't know much about Tim Curry, bar that space clip. I'm gonna be honest with you. I don't know much about him. What are roles has he done? He's in so much. He's Heisenberg. No, I don't. I don't think he is. Oh, Rocky Hour Picture Show. Oh, okay, I've not seen that in a very long time, and I probably saw that at too young of an age to under understand what's happening. I'll be honest. Clue. He's in Home Alone too. Really? Who's he in Home Alone too? I don't remember him. Concierge. Oh, he was! Oh, yeah, in the hotel. And, like, he's really on Kevin's, like, case in that movie. Now I remember him, yeah. Okay, we'll go. Uh, Tim Curry's going to space. Okay. Uh. Let's the spare fee is 150k. I don't know what currency that is. The profanity or anti-corporate slang such jargon is not accepted. Okay, I think Tim should be fine. Uh, voice verification ID. I think. I think. These groans sound best. Uh, we'll do standard orientation. Meal preference, chicken, plastic-free, vegetarian, or... I, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I like how plastic-free is the suggestion. Like, it's just chicken. It's not even meat anymore. What happened in this world? <laughs> Are you a chickenist or a vegetarian? Plastic free does it does not have a good implication. I think we just want chicken. I think we just want chicken. Please agree to the following. I have no criminal record in Terran or Martian zones. Okay. I am not a member of and never have been associated with a workers' union or other labor interest. That's a worrying disclaimer. I have completed my annual medical exam and have been cleared of having McCullough's lung. I don't know. I don't think I have his lung. I don't know who that is. I have no commercial or real estate interest on Luna in the asteroid belt or in the nation state of Arizona. <laughs> Why is Arizona singled out? Okay, uh, I will bring a positive attitude and problem-solving mindset to work every day. I understand and accept the health risks associated with long-term exposure to Vanderwall's field. I will vote for Chancellor Chun Zhang in the Pan-American Senate election. <laughs> Oh, this sounds terribly illegal. All right. Oh my good lord, the terms and conditions. Oh, it's just so much here. Read it all. I, I, I don't have time for all this. Um, 
you know, I'm, I'm just gonna, yeah, I've, I've read Article 20. That's That seems like the important one. Uh, we, we should be good. Go with that. Welcome to space. We have our contract. I, th I think that's going us, uh, uh, like us going up to clean it. Presumably from Arizona. Jesus Christ, it's not looking great. There's so much debris. Each day he steps into the yard. But well, Tim Curry. To earn his wages working hard. I pray to the stars and heaven above. To return my daddy to those he loves. I, I'm just here to destroy what's left in space. A time when he and death meet. Oh my god, there's so much traffic. Tim Curry actually voiced this. <laughs> Can you give us a space in that voice? Oh, this is gonna be my job, is it? We're gonna have to be real fucking careful. Welcome to Morrigan Station. Shipbreaker 9346. Will now begin. Please observe this important message. Space. Boundless promise. Limitless resources. A brighter future. We're getting a lot of context for it, which is actually quite cool. Hard workers like you, the backbone of civilization, will help us pave the way. Was that in the game? No, it wasn't. I'm Calicia Rye Paulson. President of Lynx Corporation Salvage Division. When my great great grandfather Exeter founded Lynx, he foresaw a remarkable opportunity among the. This South. all sounds like blatant His propaganda. Eventually brought us the rail gates. Now spanning all the way to. G like you have to bear in mind all this exposition and context here somehow has to do with me owning property in Arizona. And the people flowing through them are its lifeblood. Like, that, that's why they're saying all of this. This is going to be like a tidbit at the end after all this inspiring speech. Don't own property there. Arizona is built property of Lynx. To join the Lynx family. This is more than just a job. It's an opportunity. To be part of the largest, most This is more than a job. It's a lifestyle. In human history. We want you to never leave our company. We're your new family. We need to make you the most productive worker possible. We own you. Believe in the Lynx vision. And your legal votes. Do this, and you too will get your chance. Your first step is to join our Ever Work program. The greatest gift we give our employees. Turning death into an ongoing opportunity. Wait a minute, I don't like the sounds of that. <laughs> With Lynx, death is a fresh start. Uh oh, I don't, I... Good luck. Okay, the death's starting to scare me. I, I don't want that to happen. That... Uh-oh. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I'll be honest, I don't know if this new brand of deodorant's worth it. <laughs> yes, I want a fresh start. Press to begin genetic extraction. Video observation complete. To finalize onboarding, your genetic sequence will now be extracted for use with the Lynx Everwork Asset Replacement Program. Okay. Don't worry, pain levels during extraction are largely tolerable. Oh, great. Please note, as outlined in Section 31 of your employment agreement, the process of genetic extraction will destroy your original body. Okay. <laughs> extraction now. <laughs> Oh, 
I guess I, I, so I'm just dead. I'm just dead. Like my clone's gonna do the janitorial work. Oh yeah, I'm dead. Probably should have read the terms and conditions. Yep. I should have read the terms and conditions. Have a work. Asset replacement successful. Genetic sequence stored. Congratulations, it is now safe to die. <laughs> I think we're already dead. Oh no. I knew I shouldn't have stubbed my toe on my visit to the United States. Oh no. That's a lot of that's a lot of medical debt. Holy shit, like 1 billion dollars. Okay, let's just sign here. As someone who lives in Arizona, this is accurate. Alright, alright. Breathe. Breathe. You're okay. Everything's gonna be just fine. Oh, God. Go. Plenty of folks feel a bit woozy with the first pair. Hey, anyway, welcome aboard. The name's Weaver. Wait, what? Where? I'm where is my head? Am I just an owl? This year's Morgan Station. She may not look like much right now. <laughs> I shouldn't be able to bend my neck like that. She'll purr like a kitten. All right. Let's test out your orientation control. Do me a favor and look up at that car. Oh, I, I don't have a human body anymore, do I? I thought I was standing down. I'll stand on the ground. Hey, okay, look at the elevator. So that's where all the salvage gets collected to be picked up by the transfer crew. Just in case you ever turn yourself I'm floating, back, okay. Use your roll thrusters to reorient. Roll left. Oh no. Alright. I'm gonna now very quickly get lost. I can already tell. Okay, we have thrusters. I I don't know where I am anymore. Ascend. Descend. Mm -hmm. Looks good. Now, to finalize these movement checks, I need you to fly to these waypoints. I, I, I can do it. Just don't fall. You actually go quite slow, so it's, it's actually a fairly easy to control here. There we go. Reach the waypoint markers. Myself, you know? Till there was some, uh, yeah, we, we we can actually take our time here. We're only moving at three meters a second. Those are early days the I was worried I would just like spiral out of control. Oh, almost forgot the most important thing. Brakes. Get yourself going at a decent clip, and then test them out. Why don't you're going slow because you don't have upgrades yet. How fast am I gonna go? Oh, I I need to brake. Okay, what's happening here? Would you just... Furnace. Oh. There you go. I probably don't want to go in that, do I? Happens like first day on the job. Tim Curry's had a okay. horrific accident. <laughs> Just immediately. I gotta get it out of my system. It's okay, we have spares. That doesn't matter. That doesn't matter.
There we go. We're all right. All right. All right. Breathe. Yo, okay? Doesn't matter. Got it probably increases there. my debt, though, doesn't it? That's probably like another trillion. To the best of us. Always good to review your spare replacement form. Grapple push, yeah, grapple real. Future. This happens. Too many spares will rack up the debt, and that's how they get you. Okay. Let's get back to work. Hang on. How, how, how do I stop? Check out your hut. Here we go. You've got an object grappled. Push an object, the object and whether you can move push multi object. grapple real when grappled. Oh, I can like latch on to stuff. Okay. Oh, look at that. You can like. Ooh. Helmet damage detected. Avoid severe head trauma by following good helmet maintenance. Oh, God, I'm just trying to get a grapple on the controls. Hang on. It's tricky. Okay, stop myself. Use grapple push. I think my radio is broken. Salvage a scrap? How do I salvage a scrap? I have to push it in there. Deposit salvage. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. Let's move on to the bigger nanocarbon chunks now, shall we? You may have already noticed that these are too heavy to move with your grapple. I'm enabling your scan. How <laughs> so I just fall the into the lower up. atmosphere? Go ahead and boot it up. I'm gonna rack up so much debt. Activate the scanner. This mode of your scanner lets you assess an object structure. What I want you to focus on right now are these cut points. Hang on. Right. Controls give me the go ahead to get you cutting. You got quick access to all your tools through your HUD. Just open up your tool selector and choose the cutting tool. Cutting tool. Okay, so I'm gonna have to like dissect these bits until I can tackle bigger bits. Okay. It's designed for precision vaporization of cut points like this. Equip grapple, equip cutter. I think I have all the context I need. I think this is like like kind of self-explanatory. Hang on. So vaporize the point. Out of range. Okay, hang on. Hang on. That's how you do it. Okay. Let me boot up the processor so you and can now, see. And uh, now, do me a favor. Can I pick it up? Can I pick it up yet? Yeah, the brakes so are your friend. Right. Now look at the processor. Yeah, perfect. Wish me luck, your cutter. Me and technology ain't always. The best of friends. Hey, all right. Salvage panel. Now swap over to your grapple and toss one of those pieces. Okay. I I, I think I've got it. I think I've got it. I kinda wanna just jump into it now. Let me let me let me explore. I think I've got it. Come on. Salvage the panel. Hang on. How do I... It's just getting further away. It's taken away the handy little infographic on the bottom left for me. Hang on. Salvage it. Sal... I'm, I keep just moving further away. Pull in and then push. Uh, push. Push? Pull in. Come on. Come on. I got... I, I, I struggle a bit with space. I, I think I got it, though. I think I got it accidentally. Also, too dense for your stinger to break it down. Yeah. And there are no structural cut points for us to take advantage of. We're gonna have to. What are we gonna do, Weaver? Saw mode your cutting tool. Start slicing the Split saw mode. Side. Okay. Go ahead and switch cut modes now. Funny Irish man mispronounces simple word. I mean, honestly, that's half the streams at this point. 
The English major! Did this guy even get a degree? Equip the cutter. Swap tool mode. Now try changing the angle of the cut. Rotate the cut angle. What? Rotate cut angle? Oh, there we go. Yep. Okay, sorry. Trigger. That's just me, like... That's just me waving. Hi. Oh, that's a fun one. Oh, that's a fun one. Oh, I like this. I like this. Look at this. In they go, in they go. Reach salvage goal one. Just send it all in. God, you can send them going like quite fast. Got a surprising amount of range as well. Okay. Over here, is it? When you get there, head on in, and we'll get started. Okay, wait, but I can use my new grappling to speed myself up. I think. No, no. it's got to be a way to like slingshot myself around here. I think I just got to play with the controls a bit more. There's a button to reel in the grapple. Oh, there we go. It's L2. So we can just, like, zoom. Hey, I just want to drop by and let you know that 16 Shipbreaker devs are currently hanging out and watching your stream together. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's good to see you. <laughs> I'm, I, I apologize in advance for the amount of times... I'm going to inadvertently slingshot myself and die uh, by, like, smacking against the side of the space station. Um, it's probably... It's, probably, uh, it, <laughs> it's going to be, like, a roundtable discussion. I imagine, like, Jesus, like, he's not very good at this game. But don't worry, the tutorials are teaching me everything I need. Like, it's just... It's probably my own incompetence. So I, I wouldn't... I wouldn't be too worried here. Please bear that in mind. Level <laughs> it's like after this stream, like, do we need to make the game easier? I, I, th this guy just sucks. <laughs> okay, hard work is not going to notice you've achieved the prestigious rank of basic certification. <laughs> it's not that prestigious when you title it with basic. But all right, uh, end the shift. End the shift. Ask them if we were supposed to read the terms of service. <laughs> I, I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Hello, shipbreaker. You have one incoming transmission waiting. Oh, okay, and you kind of just go between stations here. Posters? Live, laugh, salvage. Oh, good lord. <laughs> Can I take that poster down? <laughs> oh, I can. Thank you. Decor. Yeah, that, that really brings out the place. Just the word decor. The core. Put that up. Posters. <laughs> it really brings out the room. You like my decorations. Welcome to your new home, Cutter. That's everything you need. This is officially called a ready made long term employee habitation. Something or other. Around here, we just call it your hab. Now, how's about you get yourself some rest? We'll pick up your training in the morning. It's like you hurt your head really bad on the space station. You 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 gotta get some rest. Hello, shipbreaker nine three 
4-6-52. Links would like to share the following inspirational message. Oh, I've got a lot of emails. Of your shift by fanning the tiny sparks of effort into flames of profitability. Capitalism has found us. We're not safe. Uh, I have a lot of emails. Do I need to read all these? Good morning, shipbreaker. Reminder, hum minimum payments are due by 10 a.m. Solar standard time each day. Failure to pay on time is considered a breach of contract. Thank you for your hard work and cooperation. I'm one th trillion dollars in debt. No, it's a billion, is it? It's not a trillion. Sorry, yeah, it's 200. Oh, sorry, yeah, it's, it's 252 million there and then an extra billion. It's not a trillion. God forbid. Rise and shine, I, I really need to get the work. Feel well rested. Ready to continue your training? Okay. Let's have a look at your employee terminal. Now. Oh, wait, hang on. Let's get caught up on, hang on one sec. And certification. Suit. I've sent you a message with <laughs> need to... Go on and give it a read. There you go. I just really like this decoration. You've heard of live, laugh, love. Now get ready for decor, decor, decor. <laughs> they open messages in the employee terminal. Oh, they've got the screensaver. Do you, uh, they knew exactly what they were doing. That's never going to hit the corners. Oh, you bastards. I know this is a sponsored stream, uh, like kind of a sponsored gameplay session, and you know I probably should play the game. Uh, but with the like the round table of devs in chat, would you guys mind if I spent like literally the next six hours just to see if this lines up in the corner? <laughs> would that be all right, with us? Let me just just run it by. <laughs> It's a loop. I've already seen it loop. No, no. It's got to line up at least once. That's what they always say. That's what they always say. It's got to it's got to hit that corner at least once. It's getting closer. It's getting closer. It's not looping. No, you can see it getting closer to that corner. We won't be able to pay our debts anyway. Yeah, I, I should probably check my emails. Hang on. Uh, employee terminal. Six new messages. Clear as mud. <laughs> Certification. I'm here to walk you through the process. Ranks one all the way to rank I thirty. To introduce you to some of the other shipbreakers. Most of them are willing to help you out. Good luck, shipbreaker. Okay. Right. Let's start a new shift and pick your first ship to work on. Uh, structure mode. Pre-installed in every optical cross-spectrum scanner. It's the default mode when you activate your scanner. Okay. I, I think some of these are just like kind of reference things. Here's the employee financial relief program. We're going to need this one. Everything important and, and good in this world comes with a price. Especially that, that which is imposed by us. Like we're here to help you. With the problem we've caused. You missed it, hit the corner. <laughs> okay, well, I I'm pretty sure we can pay it back. I'm pretty sure we can pay it back. Salvage goal system. Okay. Yeah, I. I th extra details. We get incentives, spares, and you. History of the company. We're at least in 2291. We're a bit in the future. With a noble profession such as shipwreck, an unplanned death is the natural pair of the job. Oh no. However, Lynx cares about the well-being and growth of our family. The introduction of Everwork Spares to replace damaged or destroyed bodies allows you to fail safely, ensure another day in the yard, and another shot in improving your skills, despite the agonizing pain it inflicts upon you. Oh, there's a new ship access available. Okay. 
outfitted with ad terminals, electrical safety is advised. Oh, even... Is all, like, like, you can't escape them on like your mobile apps and now it's like your spaceship. Gonna sell you a product. They found their way. You missed it hitting the corner now, another trillion will be added to you at that. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, enter the ship catalog. Um Don't think that's it. I don't think this was the ship catalog. Can look out the window. <laughs> it's not much of a view. I don't like the ha the handprint that kind of implies that someone was trying to like claw their way out of here. Okay, uh employee catalog. Wasn't it screensaver still going? Do I just start my shift? I'm trying to look for the catalog. Kitchen, equipment room. Yeah, I think I just start my shift. I think I just start my shift. Let's go. This screen shows This game needs a VR mod ASAP. I Honestly, I think that would be a lot of motion sickness. Or start a fresh one. I know, I know Subnautica did um, a VR mode before, but I know even with that game, uh, just because of the movement, like being in water and like kind of rotating around a lot, uh, that that'd be really intense. I, I don't know if I'd be able to handle that personally. I know some people have like a stomach of steel. Motion sickness until you die, I guess. It'd be intense, to say the least. We have a few ships. The Bellicose Firefly. The Royal Knox. The Zealous Miranda. <laughs> or the Lewiski. What ship do we want? I kind of like the Zealous Miranda. I just like the name. I'm going to go with that. Okay, reach certification level rank Volume three. Cutter. Your primary goal is to reach rank three. Now try to remember, nanocarbon goes in the processor, aluminum goes in the furnace. Question, how do I tell which is which? <laughs> we call it using the whole buffalo. You'll hit your certs faster that way and start knocking out that debt of yours. I'll be observing. Scanner. You any help if you need it. Good luck, Cutter. We were out. Okay, structural panel. Uh, where where do we want to start? There, there's our little home. Cut up the ship. Can I just like cut this bit? This is this is part of like the deposit, isn't it? Well, I guess this is all the ship, isn't it? The ship is not that. There's a ship all the way over there. Oh, the small one. Oh, this. Right, okay. Okay, sorry. Hang on. Oh, because I picked the ship, of course. Now, let me just turn around. He's blind. Gonna kind of start cutting up the station. Okay, uh, cutter. I'll be honest. Like, can I just? No, I, I can't. I can't just do that. Get a helmet light on. Oh, good lord. Okay, it's gonna take a while to break this apart. There's a lot of parts here. Not all of it is destructible. I got I gotta find like the weak point, don't I? What if I take my grapple and we just bop it? No, it's it's way too heavy for that. Okay, what what if we start with this bit? The processor. Fuck. 
find the airlock. Can I get inside the ship? There's a door here, yeah. Oh, okay, here we go. Right, so if I, um... Let's see. Cutter. Mode swap. Guess we just start cutting and hope for the best. Something's gotta come off, right? Something's gotta come. Oh, hang on, I, I need to shut the window. My headset just fell off. Oh, yeah. Warehouse full of them. Mothballed for, oh, 20 years or so. Since the oh, yeah. oh, no, my broken heads. Probably bought the whole lot for pennies. Make I'm gonna have to fix that. I'm gonna have to fix that. No word of a lie. Yeah, just keep cutting. Exactly like my stepbrother did. He even had the same Above cut grade. Expression. How are you looking on the scan? I mean, I think we're getting it. Weaver's telling us his life story, so we must be doing something right. Anyway, I'm running off. Okay, what if I, what if I start using the grapple gun? We just start getting this out. <laughs> I hope we haven't lost too much of the ship. So my idea is if I dissect it enough, like a crumple, like, because basically I don't want to have to take out like every single piece and pop it in. Into like the extraction. I want to be able to like crumple up this box and then toss it into the recycling bin in one go. Nano carbon. Wait, 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 wait. Wh which one was nano carbon again? Does that go in there or there? Hang on. Let me grab it. That one's blue. That one's blue. Oh, yeah, it says. It says. Okay. Nano carbon. Deposit salvage. We made money! Okay, I'm figuring it out. Let me let me get back inside here. We we seem to have busted open the inside of the ship, so this should hopefully like make it easier <laughs> to get stuff out. It is looking a little bit dangerous, but it should be alright. Let me, uh, mode swap? Just start by making some incisions and just see what comes off. I think that's like the best way to start. It'll start the, like, if you just hit it with the hammer, we'll get the bits we need. This is how recycling works. Chop that off. There we go. See, we, we're breaking bits of the frame. The wall's coming off. See? Now we get the grapple gun. No, it's... It's still stuck. Okay, hang on. It's still... I need to get that panel up. Oh. Yeah, be careful. Okay, don't grapple on and push. Don't grapple on and push. We're gonna get in trouble. It's all fun and games, so RT cuts the airlock and instantly goes half red. I mean, 
I don't think there's an airlock here. Like, I, the, the window is open, you know? I think we're gonna be all right. Oh, look, okay, wait, here, here's some connecty bits. Hang on. Get my cutter. Mode swap. Gonna get a bit toasty here. Wait, what? 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 <laughs> what was that? What just happened? Did I, did, did I cut it off? Oh sweet, look at all the scrap we got! Hang on. A processor. Processing object. Applying credit to account. And then furnace. Okay, so the game the game actually does make that easier for you. Get a handle on it. Look at the bottom right, there's temperature for the cutter. Your cutter overheated. Oh, okay, right. Raw material oh, thank God I turned off the time limit. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> you have four minutes remaining. Okay, cutter temperature. Oh, I see it, right. So I'm gonna need to upgrade like my power tools. We haven't been able to afford like the fancy ones that you see in the infomercials just yet. We're kind of just making do. Particle effects are beautiful. It's just, yeah, let's just go around. And like vaporize all like these connection bits. Uh, but we'll do it with this, because, you know, we're lazy. Go. Just make sure we cut the essentials. Okay, I'm going to be able to pop off this door in a moment. Are you ready? Hang on. I'm gonna be able to take this whole wall. Oh my god. Oh, look at that. That's so satisfying. That's a big chunk. That's a big chunk. Hang on. I, I, I need to get this down. This is what I mean. We're being efficient here. Come on, I gotta, it's so heavy. Come on, I gotta get you in. Make sure you go in the right one. No, not there, not there. Little bit over. Just lug it in. I've got like 425 kilos worth. Okay, don't 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 go in myself. Hang on. Oh fuck! I'm being sucked in. No. How do I? It's pulling me! It's pulling me! Oh, come on! No! <laughs> Injury detected. A ticket has been submitted for medical assistance. God damn it. <sighs> oh, the total value was $8.14. More than I thought. No cutter. I'll say 
one thing. Certainly ain't afraid of dying. You might want to try and keep your spares to a minimum. If you want to pull yourself out of debt. Don't tell me how to do my job, Weaver, right? Did you see that big piece of the ship I took off? It is gone, isn't it? Please tell me my hard work. Tell me a reset. Oh, thank God. Okay, no, we're all right. We're all right. Yeah, we just have to take off all the structural supports. And then I can, like, put the rest of this in. His stream hurts my OCD. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you just wave. Like, oh. Get a rave going. Okay, hang on. Uh, okay. Cutter? Hang on. Eh. Swap. Okay, get off all the supports. Okay, okay, wait, we, we actually might want that bit. Hang on. Goes in the furnace. Okay, it's not supposed to be falling apart this much. Oh, we may have got a few too many supports. Hang on. There we go. Okay, that's on its way. Uh, I gotta catch the rest of the ship before it falls into the lower atmosphere. Just pick it up. And bop. Hopefully this all makes it in. I, I gotta work really quickly. Here we go. Deposit salvage. Has anything gone in there? It's, it's slowly making its way. It's close enough, right? It's close enough. The entire ship is starting to fly away. Yeah, that was that was a good piece there. Oh, look at that go. Yeah, that that will gradually make its way in. Um, I really gotta hurry though, cause like the, the entire I'm losing most of the ship. Can I take this wall off, yeah. Oh, I got a lot of credits there. I need to break more of the structural supports. How do I? Is it possible for me to recenter the ship? Got her. I need to get back in. It's just gonna be a bit trickier at this angle, I think. Those pirates are still on their way. I think. Okay, let's uh let's okay, oh this is gonna be a big boy move. Okay, let's, uh, let's take off this entire wall. Okay, is it loose? It's kinda hard to tell. Hang on. Let me, let me make my way around. No, there's still supports here. Panel aluminium. Making more credits. See, they're making their way in. Okay, we got we got another bit. As long as we just don't exercise too much force, we can eventually get everything off and into the correct salvage bin. Please make it. Playing basketball with these pieces right now. 
I am starting to lose more of the ship. Let me give this a bit of a hand. Red is bad? What do you mean red's bad? I mean, I got money. Red means you're losing? Did I put it in the wrong bin? Why isn't that bit being processed? Oh, there it goes. Okay. Got it. Yellow is good, red is bad. Okay. Alright, I'm getting a handle on it. I'm learning. Come on! <laughs> I need to slice up more of the ship. Replay the tutorial! <laughs> People just join the stream. This is a lost cause. He doesn't know what he's doing. Oh, Jesus. The left panel's free, is it? I got it. Come on. <laughs> it's so heavy. Just, just catapult it. There we go. Yeah, that one's definitely in. 134,000 credits. That's so good. This bit coming off? There we go. Isn't the ship supposed to be intact? We're destroying it. We're destroying it. Don't worry. You can also push your objects with your own body or other objects. Good to know. Can I just be like with the rest of the ship here? Let's give it a push. <laughs> just get the rest of it in like that. Gonna need a running start. I love the music, it's so relax relaxed. Uh, it's, it's giving me like real kind of, uh, I don't know how many people here have seen Firefly. But it's giving me vibes from that show. Pop that in. Oh, we got every bit of the wall. Let's catapult you. If you can hit your friends there. Processing object. Applying credits to account. They actually make a fair bit of money from doing this, it seems. Like 60,000 credits. I'm not entirely sure how much it's gonna let me buy, but like it sounds good, don't it? Okay. I need I need to there's still a bunch of yellow things. I, I just need to like dissect the entire thing. I think it's gonna be my game plan for the next ship, just cut it all apart. And then like we just try and like bundle it under our arms. Cutter. I'm surprised there's not more consequence for me just like making incisions everywhere inside the ship. Well, I'm not gonna question it because it's by far the most effective means to do this.
You fool. <laughs> I'm only losing some money for the pieces I destroy, right? I don't think it's that bad. Yeah. Realign ourselves. Look at that, we got almost all the yellow bits. There's only like one structural support left. And now we can just like pick it all up. Okay, wh which one does this all need to go into? The furnace? Okay, we just need to pick up the loose pieces now. Some of this needs to go in the processor. Furnace. Just try roughly aim it. Okay, and this looks mostly like a processor piece, right? So, line her up. Deposit not accepted. Wait, wait, there's a furnace. Uh, it, no, it's too late. It's too late. Put it all in. Put it all in. Someone else can sort it out at the recycling plant, see? I've done the first sweep. And now their job is just to fix what got put in each bin. 88,000 credits left. Oh, shit. What do you mean I'm the recycling plant? I'm like the bin man here. I'm the demolitionist. I don't gotta sort this. I, I, I sort it vaguely. I think we did a good job. I think we did a good job. Put a few more bits in. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> yeah. And now we just collect like the loose bits of space candy. I think that's most of it. There's a fair bit of debris that's fallen into the lower atmosphere, but honestly, like we can just start the next ship and we'll like make up we'll get gain more money that way. Raw material Credits deposited. I think we've done good. Yeah, let's hop on back. We can rank up now. The red on top says how much salvage you've lost. That's not that bad. That's not that bad. We got like a four out of five. You go to a four star restaurant or a four star hotel, that's a damn good hotel or restaurant. I can't get much better. You'd have to be snobby at that point to be like, oh no, I can't go there. It's not five star cuisine. See, so salvage, we made two million dollars, and we only lost 200 grand. That's a massive return. It's a massive return. We did amazing. <laughs> the glass was destroyed, the nano carb was destroyed. 1,000 kilos of aluminium. <laughs> We're destroyed. <laughs> That's, that sounds quite valuable. That's actually a lot. Holy shit. A thousand kilos. I'm sure that's fine. We're recruit now. We're no longer basic. Look at that. We did so good. Give me a new ship. I've got a handle on it now. I can do this with next one so much better. I know what I'm doing now.
The game congratulated me. And I'm pretty sure all of the devs watching just clapped. I think we're doing something right. Good morning, Shipbreaker. Reminder, minimum payments are due by 10 a.m. standard time each day. How much is my minimum payment each day? I, could, I, I need a lot more money to, like, pay back this debt. What's the minimum payment? Now go ahead and pick another ship. Let's pick another one. I don't know. It was in the terms of service. We got anything new on the employee t terminal? New ship? Okay. Oh, I want to do that heavy cargo. Oh, that's that sounds amazing. Have you felt warmed? Oh, it burns. Flesh, skin, soul. Have you felt as warmed yet, my friends? What a privilege it is to be walking in his light. To feel the touch of the furnace god in our skins. The purest way to be reborn. First time he took me, it was the first time I died too. His pull, stronger than any other, engulfed me, cradled me. His fire burning with a, the life of a thousand suns. What more could one ask than for to experience the cleansing fire and to live to see in better day? Is there a purer death? I could see all he sees. I could feel his hunger. His warmth in the cold vastness of the universe. It is where he gives life. Oh, agony, Pat? Once I had known his touch, I knew it was the way. I know your struggles, fellow cutters. It's a dangerous job after all, but the furnace god is just. His fire washes away all injuries, if you so choose to embrace his warmth. All flows, all flaws inflicted by our daily chores shall be gone. If only you choose to go into his light. We've got to start each day by just, like, burning in the furnace now, I think. I can actually make a religion out of this. <laughs> also, hazard! Fire! <laughs> you want to be careful there. The Lynx kiosk is your one-stop shop for all your shipbreaking needs. It dispenses all the items that any self-respecting shipbreaker wouldn't leave the, the hab without. Uh, we should probably get some of this. They're available for purchase at market rates and already factor in your 1.7% employee discount. That's pretty good. Pretty good. This company has my best interests at heart. Okay, so can I can I use the kiosk now to buy stuff? Everything's at a hundred percent. I don't need to repair it yet. Uh, I I really need to improve the laser cutter if I can. Tier requirement? Oh no, n nothing has been met. Absolutely. Okay, I'm I'm not strong enough. Kiosk is outside while you're on shift. Is it? Oh, okay. Well, am I able to get anything yet? It looks like here I, I don't have a lot available. Or is that, is that rank one stuff? Is like that's what I can get. <laughs> Equipment's all well and good. What about the stickers? Oh yeah, no, this this is this is important. This is important. Okay, we just need 150,000 kilos of nanocarbon. And then we can get our decals on. Oh, that's a goal right there. That free time is money. <laughs> that's, that's a hell of a progress bar. <laughs> it's gonna take some while. Yeah, I don't think we can afford any of the stickers right now. Uh, let's start our shift. Pick a ship. So here's the heavy cargo one. I kind of want to do that. The Roberts Mark 7. Do you want to go the shippy? Uh, Ikazuchi. Or the Roberts. I think the, I think the same ship. 32,000. Oh, no, no, wait. No, this one's heavier. That one's more valuable. 
Yep, we want the Roberts. Shippy McShip face, please. <laughs> okay, all right, I'll, I'll, I'll take it just because the name is funny. All right. Okay. We'll kill Shippy instead, then. It's weird. People are attached to this ship. It's like, no, Daniel, please pick that one. I want to see it die. Like, oh, okay. Okay, so this one, I, I, have, a, I have a plan. We're getting inside the ship, and then we're cutting it All up right. from the inside. Hold up a second there, Cutter. Because you've increased your rank, we're going to give you the next greatest ship. Now this one will be full of machines, oh, he's giving me a run there. electronics, furniture, all stuff that Lynx can collect and resell. You're going to want to throw those items on the barge. That's uh, the big green thing below you. Go ahead, have a look. Oh, that's a objects or component down there. Don't worry about breaking anything. There's a dampening. That's a new one. Works great. Most of the time. Okay. Give it a go. Some objects can be detached with your grapple. Look for the detach prompt on your reticle. Okay, so I so it's, it's gonna tell me if something has to go down there, is it? Go into the light. <laughs> I don't think I should do that just yet. Uh, where's the entrance on this ship? Mott mentality. <laughs> I gotta go. I gotta. I gotta do it. Okay, here's the hatch. Yeah. Okay. So it'll tell me if I can just take like a part. We just pick it up. Like that, is it? Yeah, okay, so if it's still intact, that's where it goes. Okay. Uh, fuel tank. We should probably take these out. I feel like this could go badly. Alex, it's stuck. Hang on. Okay, I'm gonna have to go in to get this out. Gonna need a flashlight here. Oh my god, there's a, this thing is primed to explode. Okay, we, we can't start cutting yet. We gotta get this out of here. Oh no, it's stuck in the door. Oh, come on. I should not be doing that. I should not be doing that. Oh no, okay, that one's gone. That one's gone. <laughs> that one's... Please observe salvage destination. I gotta be really careful with this. A lot of bits here. Hey, wait, I, I can I can take this bit off. That looks valuable. That's two hundred grand. Oh my god, that's like that's like uh, uh, that's a huge percent of the value. There you go. Let's get both those off. Okay, we're gonna. I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my best. Take this off, too. Chuck. How exactly does it get back to Earth? When it goes in there. Oh no, okay, it's just it's just gonna collect them. It's gonna it's gonna fly back later. I imagine I wanna be careful that I don't get stuck in here. 
Okay, cut point. If I maybe op like remove some of the roof, or like make it more opening points, I can probably get the fuel out without like everything exploding in my face. I think that's what I have to try and do. Because it, it's so dangerous in here right now. Processing valuable object. Credits awarded. Cause a lot of damage. I have, okay, I'm gonna have to be careful here. I, I think I can make an opening, but we're gonna have to be really precise. Don't hit the fuel canisters. Just don't hit the fuel. I, I still need to, like, cut a hole in the side. Okay, if I take stock with the f Okay, this, this is gonna look real dangerous. I know what the fuel canister is, right? <laughs> Salvage destroyed. Please revisit your training. It's alright. Just don't... Don't go near the canister. Uh, Cutter? That thing was supposed to go onto the barge? Let's try this again. Hey, what was that? Oh, it's fine. It's fine. He's getting a bit antsy. Hang on. Mode swap. Gotta get this out. I can't see. <laughs> Where in the ship? Am I in the vent? <laughs> I don't know where I am anymore. Oh, I shouldn't have said vent. Shouldn't have said it. I forget there's many gamers among us. <laughs> We're like frantically reaching for the keyboard. I think I'm actually stuck. <laughs> Can I just like car? Okay, I'm. G okay, this, this is a bold move. I hope I'm fate. Let me use the scanner. How do I get out? <laughs> I don't know how I got stuck in here. Oh no, now, now I'm really stuck. Uh... I, th I think I've actually wedged myself. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No, we're good, we're good. I don't think I'm supposed to be in here at all. Trapped inside the spaceship. Oh, thank God. Okay, there's the exit. I don't... Don't hit the tanks. I can get this hatch out. Hang on. Mode swap. I pop this open. I can get rid of the explosives. God, I gotta be careful. <laughs> I gotta be 
really careful. It's bouncing off some of these. I hope it just doesn't hit anything. Oh god, that makes me nervous. Wait, 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 we're facing the wrong way. Hang on. Come on. Get in there. Cargo hatch acquired. Now, let me teach you about the kiosk. Once the training wheels come off, Link's regulations mean you gotta cover your own oxygen and fuel. Costs. I can get some more. I can get some more parts. Let's go back and do that. Hang on. It's gonna be a tough ship. Now, no need to panic. They'll last you a good while. But if you end up played out or wild, you should be a pro at spacesuit travel. I sucked at spacesuit travel. Let's have a look. In that game. That was so bad. Welcome to Vendetron 9000. Okay, I don't think I actually need oxygen because we're, pl we're playing the game on easy mode. <laughs> Fix up your helm suit and helmet. Burn in the dark void of space. Stimulant disinfectant and vitamins. Do I need anything right now? Got a sticker. Right. I'll leave you to it. We'll chat again when you hit the next rank. Weaver out. See you, Weaver. Okay, with that hatch, if I can get a, another hatch on the bottom, uh, I can just pop all those fuel canisters out, and then I can do my plan of dissecting the entire ship in one go. I think the ship, if I had to guess, is mostly processors. So we're gonna shove it into a processor, like the entire ship. I need to get this this hatch open. Okay, that's the main goal right now. So, speed this up. Go. Start cutting. We didn't need that bit of aluminium. Get the yellow bits. Give that a slice. Just gotta be precise. See? Like, we can get, like, two for one on some of these. Look at that, we've already opened it. Get this panel. Oh, wait, hang on, no, this is, this is apparently an animate carbon rod. Uh, let's send that off over there. Yeah, I, I, I think it's mostly processors. I think it's mostly stuff for the processor. Pick off like a few bits that are like, okay, this is this obviously goes in the barrage or something. Wait, 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 wait. Hang on. I wasn't supposed to hit that. Hang on. Wait, wait, oh, that, that, that big thing on it. Hang on. Hang on. Let me, let me pull it back. Whoa, there. Whoa. You got a barge, boy. Hang on. I, I don't think I can get it out of there now. No, it's already, it's going in. These things have their own gravitational pull. Yeah, it's gone. There's nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. Oh no, that airlock was valuable. <laughs> uh, 
Oh no. Okay, that's all right. I can finally get these fuel canisters out of here. All right. To the barge you go. Is that a pickup? Suit patch kit? Oh, okay. I can just take that for myself, apparently. I can take this, too. Hang on. Wait, wait. Wait, no. <laughs> oh, it's gone. Well, I'll, I'll grab what I can. Oh, I think... I think it hit, hit the barge. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good. Okay. Right, now we get back to our goal of uh, cutting off all the important bits. Yeah, there we go. And then we're just gonna gear it on up, right? Cut that off. Hey, Carter. I need you to head back to the kiosk on the starting platform to fill up your O2 stat. Well, I'm low on oxygen? Oh, hang on, wait. Is this a bad time to be low on oxygen? I feel like half the ship is floating away. <laughs> hang on. I don't think I have much of a choice here, though. Hang on, I'm here! I'm here! <laughs> Pull! 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 Oh, this is getting bad. <laughs> I can't see. How do I patch it? How do I <laughs> Let me quickly check my inventory. Can we uh, pop a cheeky repair kit? <laughs> No, no, I don't think I can. Well, that's real unfortunate. I'm really far I abandoned my post? Oh, I hit like a safety perimeter. That's what killed me. I would have been fine then. I'm impressed by your commitment. I really am. But keep an eye on that spare account. Spares are surefire way of racking up the fees. Real fast. I think we have a few more spares. We'll be all right. I think we'll be okay. Okay, let me, let me get back to like cutting up the ship here. And deposit salvage. There we go. Yeah. Once it kind of goes in its general vicinity, it, it tends to just like gravitate in. You just got to be careful not to go past the hazard lines yourself. Yeah, I got to be careful not to be Spider-Man this time. That, that, that was the problem there. I was trying to get back for the oxygen too much. Gotta, gotta take my time. Yeah. 
Go in there. Anyone see the bits we gotta chop? And there's one in there. Uh, you know, oh, I, I can't get in there. If I, yeah, if I just push the entire thing. Honestly, honestly, we just start pushing it. Yep. Okay, furnace or processor gang? Which way do we think it should go? Okay, hang on. Wait, wait. Okay, I can get I can get this bit in. I can get this bit in. Oh, no, 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 no. We're okay. Oh my god, what what did that speed up? Be sure to always budget for helmet repair costs. My radio's malfunctioned again. Uh, am I gonna need- I need to repair that, don't I? I probably need to repair my helmet. The, the, the crack in it is probably not helping me, is it? Let me just, uh, make my way back. We'll buy some new oxygen. Suit patch kit. Have a nice day. Yeah. Yeah, let's see if we can push what's left of the ship into the processor bay. I want to try just get this entire thing in. Oh, oh, that's very cheeky. There's like an explosive drum down here. Need to make sure that we cut these bits off. Very cheeky. Can I take it off? There we go. Okay, we're not we're not gonna get caught out by that. All right, rest of it. I'm pr yeah, rest of it in, j but most of it. Let's, let's push it in. This is like you know how you don't want to make two trips to get the groceries in, so you try take all the bags in one go. Okay, in it goes. Yeah, most of that is being processed. Most of that is being processed. There's gonna be a bit, a few red deductions, but it's not gonna be that bad. Most of this is processed. Because the thing is, I can just get another ship. This is quantity over quality here, is what we're offering. Oh, you weren't supposed to go in there. Pretty good. Now we just need to get the other half of the ship in. Um, the frame here is all for the forge. Uh, but then, then a lot of this needs to be processed, so... A lot of this needs to be processed. 
Uh, is there a way to separate it? Yeah, there's like there's like one or two joints left. Hang on. Oh, I need I need to move this out. There's so many sneaky drums. Come on. Go. That, that's that's making its way there. So many sneaky oil drums just trying to murder you in this. Should be safe now. Cut right through that. Oh, did we get the fort, the the frame out? I think we did. I think we got some of it. We just try blast it a bit. We can get some of this moving. Come on. Jesus. Okay, keep it together. Keep it together. We got a lot of shopping to manage this time. Keep it together. Got to make sure it goes in the right cupboard. No, oh, my training's all good. Training's all good. Give it a push. The state of the ship is not looking too good right now. Cutter, make your way back to the kiosk on the starting platform to fill up your own tube. Hang on, I can okay, let me just okay, I've got most of the process bits. That all needs to be in the furnace. Hang on. Just push that stuff in. And then this bit. This bit needs to go over here. Come on. I can do it in time. Come on. Okay, get get some more oxygen. Alright, I, I need to work out that last piece. Hang on. I'm almost there. Okay. Come on. Get on the terminal. Get on the terminal. Woo. We're all right. See, we had it all under control. Let drum go in. Oh my god, it's just one thing after another. There's still a drum here. Out of there. I've got a lot of these. I do want to see what happens with the next ship if I just detonate those. Can I just make it go in the dr like in the right bins? Like instantly. I think we'll have to try that next. Right, come on. Come on. And guide. That's a big piece there. That's got to be worth something. Oh no, is that not going in? Come on. Come on, down a bit. Down a bit, come on. There you go, he's on his way. That's gotta be worth like something. That, that's a huge chunk of metal. Valuable object 
That's gotta be worth something. Oh, like that just jumped up. There was so much in there. Okay, what what's left of the ship? These are all just, like, spare pieces of it. Pass that in there. Can I even move this? I, I think this one is stuck. There's one blue bit on it, but, like, it's fine. It's fine. Like, so sometimes, like, oh no, you pop, like, you know, a plastic container in, like, the compost bin. <laughs> That doesn't sound great, does it? <laughs> I don't think I can write that one off. It's just a glass bottle in the compost bin. It can't cause that much damage. No, no, that's that's gonna really hurt someone. I I need to get this bit off. Yeah, I see it. Come on. Fuel, we're gonna, we have enough fuel. We have enough fuel. We're gonna make it home. It's just this one massive piece. This is gonna be worth so much. Are you ready? Like we accomplished our aim and we got to be kind of lazy about it. I think that's like a win-win scenario. Let me just get some extra pieces. Look at that meter just shoot up. Like we lost a single door. You know, I, I think I'll be able to sleep at night. I think I'll be okay. Now we just kind of pick up the loose bits of debris. Wait, the other engine still? Wait, wait. Where's the engine? What are you guys talking about? Is that not in? Oh, that's in. Trying to see if there's any other bits of debris. Oh, Jesus! I gotta be careful. Put that in. Gonna use my fishing line here. We just get the piece, blast it. We just, uh, Hook in on that. Oh, gee. Warning. Okay, I'm going home. I'm going home. Links recommend regular gentle Hang exercise up. to increase blood oxygen levels. Going home. Take me in. Take me in. How? <laughs> I made it! And we salvaged 3.8 million dollars. That's 71%. 71%. Don't look at the destroyed bit. Look at the important stat. We made a profit. Look at all this. Yeah, scroll down. Look at all the green. Look at all the green. And only like 96 kilos worth of fuel tanks were lost. Look at all the green. You're right. Scroll down. Bask in my accomplishments. I got 6,700 kilos of nanocarbon. We did amazing.
Rank up. I'm now a beginner. License level increased. Is that really a prestigious rank? I don't know if it is. Oh, give me one second. Hang on. Sure, everything's good. Good morning, Cutter Nine. Still hasn't hit the corner. Today's weather report. New message received. Career progression clearance. Now qualified to handle electrical hazards during salvage. We got a promotion because we did so well. New ship, the mackerel. Oh, I want to destroy it. I got a jack me up sticker. That's a really unfortunate name. <laughs> Reach a velocity of at least 20 meters per second. I'm looking at the stats coming from your bay, and it's looking like you're really gonna make your Look way at that, even Weaver's congratulating us. Time to learn about how to upgrade your equipment, and some of the more advanced tools you'll soon have at your disposal. Head on over to your workbench in the equipment room, and we'll see about upgrading your tools. Okay, equipment. God, I've, I can apply my stickers, too. Hang on, hang on one second, Weaver. This is important. One side unlock. How did I, I thought I did the tutorial. Okay, I haven't unlocked that. Look at that. I can slap that on the gun. I only get one. Only get one. I'm gonna read this straight from the manual. <clears throat> Lynx rewards hard work and learning by giving shipbreakers access to tool improvements and new equipment. Reaching salvage goals is essential for becoming a master shipbreaker. Basically, they want to make sure you prove yourself first before giving you the big guns. Completing salvage goals will net you shiny Lynx tokens. Use those tokens here to get yourself some new Okay. Gear. So let's get going and learn about one of the most important tools in a shipbreaker's toolbox, tethers. Go ahead and purchase them. Uh, where, where are my tethers? Equipment? Thrusters? Oh, here we go. Tether module. That is going to be deployed to establish two electro electromagnetic anchors that pull objects along a field medium. Repeat after me, Cutter. Okay. Tethers are your friends. Now, have a quick read, and let's hop back in the bay. Okay. So we can use these to retract the pull connected objects together. You can also use the pull objects into the process of furnace or barge for efficient and quick salvaging. Place the first contact point, drag the connection to another object, and release the trigger to complete the connection. I, I, okay, I've got, I've got an idea for the next one using the tethers. Hang on. Oh, I've got an amazing idea. Hang on. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, current ship. I don't think there's much to continue. There's just a training ship next. I take it I have to do the train. I mean, there's nothing left of this ship. Wait a minute, that's not a ship. They're great for moving super heavy salvage. Try it out. Press and hold the secondary input for the grapple to begin placement. Point where you want the salvage to move to, then release the input okay. to create the tether. So I can I can just daisy chain stuff. Oh no. 
Now, what if you want to get rid of the tethers you've already placed? There's a cancel command. Did they just start pulling stuff together? Take note. That, uh, that, that one's on the wrong one. Hang on. Go ahead and try it now. There you go. Hang on. Let me uh, just... Gotta... Gotta get these together. Yeah. There you go. Now, you've got unlimited tethers during this training exercise. But after this, when you need more, you'll have to buy them from the kiosk. Oh, no. How well you can handle them. Try and clear out a bunch I'm of gonna be scared crap. to use them. You can stack multiple I've got a limited supply. Increase the pull force. You can also chain objects of any size together to move them as a group. I'm gonna be so scared. Do incredible things with a daisy chain of tethers. Tether the cubes. So what do I gotta do? Have I gotta just get them all to the barge? Can I just like... Do I just need to push him? Place a tether in the barge. Like that? Is that gonna start to just take them all down? My mission says tether cube. Oh, that means get them there, yeah. Okay, so that, that is slowly gonna start, like, transporting them. If I do that, then it's gonna break the tether. It's gonna take a while till they get down there, I think. Got a daisy chain going. Red means the tethers will wear out. Okay. So I'm just gonna send these ones on their merry way. So it's better if you just do it one at a time rather than just try to do the massive daisy chain I've been attempting here. More tethers equals more force. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. <laughs> it's like, down All he right. goes. Well done, Cutter. Like I said. Yeah, that goes way faster. Friend. Once you get the hang of them, you can get pretty creative on how you use them. Now, when you're ready, let's go back to the hab. And, and just cancel the tether if I want to slingshot it. Okay. okay let's make our way back home. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying to get the handle on this. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I think we're. I think. I think we're okay. <laughs> We got back in, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's incredibly violent, but if it works, it ain't stupid. <laughs> Good morning. What was that sound? Uh, that was the sound of my skull compressing. Hours of sleep. Any extra sleep time will be docked from the next pay cycle. Oh no. Oh, there's a lot of daily fees here. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, I'm ready to start. I want to do one more ship. Oh, we got level threes. This is the electronics ones, aren't they? These are electronics. I, I really want to try one of these. Let's do the little whiskey.
I'm so sorry if that scares the shit out of anyone whenever I, like, smack my head <laughs> against the door. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It is my distinct honor and privilege to introduce you to the rest of the crew in our sector. Sound off, everyone. Hey, Rook. Name's Luke. I was the worm until you showed up, so thank you. Now I... Get to do the hazing. Can we just push it in? What are you talking about? We don't do that. Can I just push board. the entire ship in, don't please? Please, I, I really want the. Kai, your mic's still messed up. Okay, well, I mean, that took off a bit of it. How about now? Better. No, 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 no. Mic's still busted, huh? Yeah, still waiting on the wreck to get uh, Heaven forbid they give us functional gear. I'm sure they're working on it as fast as they can. Cutter, I added you to the sector comms channel. It can get long Trying to get it down to the barge. The Can't believe I was able to tear that entire unit off. Alright. Enough chin wagon. Let's get back to it. We were out. <sighs> Goodbye. All right. Later, Rook. That's pretty good. Okay, the entire ship has now moved. Let's detach. I'm, I'm kind of worried the entire ship is going to go on the barge at this rate. Okay. How many tethers am I gonna need for this to work? We need to make sure it's on new pieces each time. It's real. It's not. It's not moving. It's not moving. What if I try apply more tethers? And then I'll push it from the other side. Yeah. It's still, it's still not moving. It's still not moving. Okay, I, I need to cut this bit off. Cause this is just gonna, this is just getting in the way. There you go. At the very least, even if the tethers don't work here, we're making a lot of money. Oh no, the tethers are expiring. That they don't last long. I'm trying to think, if there's a better way to do this. I was able to push the entire ship before. Maybe there's something inside that can help me. Oh no, there's a teddy bear. Let's save him. We captured the killer of Kerbinog? What? <laughs> Sorry? I just need to take everything off the walls. Arsh! Arsh! Oh no! 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 Yeah, be 
careful pulling out the electronics. If I just pick off enough bits of it, it should eventually move. Okay, just lock a few more of them off. Go back and get oxygen. I'm gonna try a gentle, gentle recall here. That I think I've got I've got a handle on it. We we, we did. <laughs> We didn't smash our skull that time. Pretty good. Can I get something out of the barge to use as a weapon? Can I use one of these? No, th th those seem kind of like stuck in space. Is this just, is it just me or is this getting lower? Might be. As a weapon. Well, I'm thinking is if I get something big, I can smack it against the ship and hopefully, like, get it moving. Maybe I can use this. No, it's not it's not strong enough, is it? Might be moving a little. Come on. Come on. It's too much. I think it's tethered to something accidentally as well. It's working, but slowly. <laughs> I, ju I just need to get inside and, like, cut it to pieces. It might be kind of hard to do because we filled all this space with junk. It's all right. Just look for the incision points. It's a lot of valuable scrap here. Push this open? One more. That's enough, yeah? There we go. Pop that in there. Best soundtrack. The music is really good. It's like it's actually very relaxing as you do this. Didn't lose too much from doing that. And now I can just like cherry pick everything out of the ship. <laughs> the love of God. Cat spider about it. <laughs> Injury detected. This incident may be recorded for training and quality purposes. Every time I try spider about it, every time. It doesn't go well. I probably should have used the tether there.
Oh, the ship is definitely moved. <laughs> I need to like cut it in two. I just need to slice the ship down the middle. Uh, that, that's the goal. Get inside and just cut it to pieces. There you go. Yeah, okay, here we go. This is all, like, looks like integral to the structural integrity of this. This is the stuff we want. Right, hang on, let's try and get in here. So much here. Tear it all the pieces. I'm finally gonna do what I want here. Where I put it in in one go. Mostly. Mostly. That, that can all just stick around. Like, the ship's getting lighter now, see? How much was shaving off? Get out of the way. I just want to put a ship in and see what happens. Still too heavy. Still too heavy. If there was something I could use to explode the interior, that would be ideal. Yeah, we're gonna have to cut off more of the connection points. Don't need that. Got another opening in here. It's in here. Large furnace. It's just a bottle. It's not even worth that much. Okay, well, it's three ta- No, it's a hundred dollars. That's an expensive bottle. Jesus. Try the tethers. I don't know if the tethers are gonna work from here. This structure seems really secure. Come on. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll try tether it again. All right. Maybe it's light enough now. Go in. Oh my god, it's moving. Okay. Gotta give it a little bit of kick. It, it, okay, it's taking off a large section. <laughs> oh my god, it's working. <laughs> okay, push it in. Push it in.
We just broke off like half the chocolate bar here. Oh no, it might be going in the wrong one though. We, we, we need to push it. I can't believe this has come up. Okay, I, I can use another tether, hang on. Pull it in! Oh, there we go, it's perfect! Okay, how much are we gonna get? There's a lot of components in that. I can't believe that's actually worked. I'm aware of the oxygen. Okay, it's gonna start tallying. It's gonna start that There's a lot of costs involved at both sides. That's pretty good. That filled a whole bar. Quickly, Spider-Man. Oh, that's so good. We made so much money off that. Look, the, the ship is closer. The, the ship is also sinking into the, the barge below. I wonder if we should just, like, park it there. <laughs> just pop it in. It seems that the tethers can pull off entire sections. So if I find, the, like, the structural supports, specifically for, like, the, the pods of the ship. Let me see where they are. I think it's- is it those ones there? Kinda hard to see. In these, like, wall sections. Let's just slice through that. Actually, I gotta be careful, because because that, that means if I pop the tethers on, I think that's gonna tear off that wall. Let's try it. I gotta be careful. Let's do it. Tether? Another tether. That's fine, that's fine. It's pulling it. It's pulling it. Okay, I can do it. It's pulling the entire thing right now. Oh, that's that's a bad tether. <laughs> I'm going to need to buy more of them. It's moving. Get more tatters. <laughs> We're putting that ship in the bin. <laughs> I've made this my goal. Headers restored. Okay, I'm gonna need them. Uh, we should probably get some fuel. Gotta spend money to make money. Okay, if I put all, apply all 20 tethers, I can get this in now. Let's just drag the shit. Pick apart an entire spaceship, piece by piece. Deconstruct it, 
and salvage it for the most valuable materials. Or we can recycle it. Just, just do the lot. One go. Quick and easy. Oh. Okay, I, I gotta get on this side of the ship. Hang on. Yeah, this, this is a dangerous spot to be. Thankfully, it's moving kind of slow. Giving me time. Pop the tethers. It's moving. Keep applying them. I can fit some more on. We're gonna need more tatters. Tether supplies dropping. I gotta be real careful not to be sucked in. <laughs> oh! Your oxygen reserves are low. Note that excess carbon dioxide can cause damage to Link's equipment. Cutter? Looks like you used your last tether. Head on over to the It's stuck? No, it's not. It's still moving. You kidding me? It, th this is gonna make it. This is gonna make it. I, I, I need to get some more. Why the fuck did I tether it there? I need more tethers. And some more. Tatters. That's the real reason we came back. Oh, it's so close. <laughs> it's gonna be really hard to apply the tatters from here is the, my main concern. We gotta get uncomfortably close to this void. Just don't, don't let it suck you in. I don't think this one is, is like, black hole-ish. It's got, it's gonna make the UI a little funky. That's okay. We tether up. That that was a bad tether. <laughs> it's still moving. I gotta go a little further in. Let me try and get on the other side. It's we're so close on this. Oh, that's a big movement. I think we got it. It's going in. Oh my god, we did it. We did it. it. That's enough. That's enough. We're gonna recycle it in one fucking go. Here we go. <laughs> it's going in. Salvage gold 
There we go. <laughs> Oh, the red's going! <laughs> oh, we might be a little more in the red this time. Thumbs up, though! Look, that was a for funsies project, right? I think we accomplished what we said I have to do there. We absolutely succeeded. <laughs> I'm the worst recycler. Let's bring it on home. <laughs> it's like. What have you done? It was 3,000 kilos of aluminium. Look, we got all the panels. The credits earned is still a positive, right? We didn't do a good job of recycling the ship, but we still made money. We're not trying to save the planet here. We're just trying to make a profit, right? Yeah, you, know, you pick out the tin cans from the recycler and you just burn the rest. Job done. <laughs> we recycled the entire ship. Hello, ship breaker. You have one incoming transmission waiting. Oh, what's going on? on the intercom. Hey, Rook. I was thinking our crew should crack some beer See? Sometime. You know, shoot the breeze. Lou is here to congratulate us on doing such that. an amazing job. <laughs> Not that that's going to happen anytime soon. Gonna... Like, Weaver's been at this for years. That's such a success. Maybe? I was just getting kicked out of grade school when he started. <laughs> Dee Dee sends most of her money home. Goes through lengths, of course. With huge transfer fees. And Kaido. Well, look. Kai's great. He just hasn't really taken to the work. Lynx calls him a low earner. As for me, I'm trying to get there as fast as I can. Gonna go out and get beer soon. Give me one of those mining skips. You know, for belt running. Still so many rich rocks along the frontier line. Eventually want to hire some friends from back home. The Earth platforms. Round Mars? Good people. But work's hard to find there. Hmm. Don't know when that'll be, though. Just when I think I'm earning at a steady clip, there's another fine or fee. This job's fun as hell and all, but I got other plans. Maybe you do, too. Anyway, don't want to get a fine for tying up comms? Kidding! How long That's is it going to take thing. us to earn a profit? I'm I just starting think. to think about that. <laughs> Either way, good luck, Rook. Blew out. We came here to make money, but we're still massively in debt. Good morning, ship breaker. Your theta wave level. Oh, survived. we got the bunny. Please administer two caffeine pods before starting your shift. Look at this guy. Was one of dozens of characters that introduced as part of Pantaran Media Conglomerate's Fun Friend Animals pilot program. The program featured a wide range of stylized animal-based characters, and heavy psychological analysis was used to determine which of these characters were most popular. Despite appearing very similar to bunny characters A, B, C, E, and G, bunny character D was determined to be the most popular among children aged 4 to 12. Interestingly, bunny character F, while being the least popular this age group, reportedly due to disturbing facial features, proved most popular among those aged 25 to 40, and is featured in a series of video games that, of videos and games for adults. Several of the program's characters, notably Moose character, Pigeon characters A to C, and Salmon character, were determined to be unpopular because they were based on animals that have been extinct for over 100 years. Uh-oh. In the latest video series, Bunny does the right thing. Bunny character D opens an ice cream shop in New York. However, after blight rats infest the shop, the Hell administration forces the shop to close. Many of Bunny character D's friends encouraged them to apply for government small business assistance to help them get a new shop. 
However, a wise government official helps Bunny Character D understand that the best thing they can do is not apply. This will necessarily draw valuable finances away from the government. It could be used for the betterment of society elsewhere. The moral of the story is the trust in market forces and in government to make the best decisions for everyone. <laughs> What a, what a fun kids show. Uh, once again, I feel this is... I'm escaping to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space! <laughs> they got us again. Got us again. The horror game. <laughs> Beast total, but look at the salvage income. Look, like, see, people say we made a loss. We didn't. We made a loss in terms of assets, but that's not what we're focused on here, because they're not my assets really to begin with. I'm not paying the like the destroy the these ships. They're just being handled, like handed to me. Strictly a game. How you holding up there, Cutter? Seems like you're getting the knack for it. Trust me. Oh, you God get almighty. Well in the art of ship breaking, okay. I think I'm going to pause it there. Uh, let me... Let me cut to this view here. Um, thank you. Uh, oh, hang on. Wait, 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 hang on. One, wait. Oh, one second. Hang on. My computer's freaking out. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> going wrong. What's going wrong? For some reason my PC likes to just randomly, like, disable Chrome on everything sometimes. Like, it just shuts down. It just shuts down. I don't know why. Okay, we're good? We're good. I got it back. I'm just refreshing it. Yeah, thank you. Focus Entertainment, again, for the sponsor. Um, it, it, It's a bit funny, because, like, the, the stream itself isn't sponsored. Like, the, the video that comes from the stream is, but it's like, you, you kind of just... Lump them together. If you want to check out Hired Space Shipbreaker for yourself, there's a link in the description. Uh, and there'll be video highlights of this up on the YouTube channel uh, in the near future, too. Hi, YouTube. Yeah, say hi now. So hi, Archive people. And I had actually, like, surprisingly good fun with this. I kind of like the dystopian presence that's kind of, like, permeated through everything. Um, I... I Love the soundtrack. It, uh, it's actually like a really good part of this. It's just the right kind of uh, it, it's really like you can tell the devs watched a lot of Firefly, honestly, or like Cowboy Bebop and stuff like that. It's always that like precise use of jazz that kind of indicates these influences. But yeah, there's a link in the in, link in the chat there. Check it out for yourselves, and there will be some eventual YouTube highlights I think from this session uh, that we've been playing. Uh, I had a lot of fun playing this. Uh, I have one other thing that I want to check out tonight on this stream. Uh, it's another game, and I wanted to get it in just because I know I'm not going to be able to do another stream uh, until, like, the weekend. So I thought, you know, we go a little bit longer tonight, and we're going to try to do a twofer. It's not Genshin Impact. It's not. One of these days it will be. One of these days it will, and you're all going to be scared. Yeah, give me give me two seconds here because I gotta oh, PS5. If it wants to. Temperamental sometimes. Yeah, there's another game that I I, I actually really want to play tonight. Uh, I definitely want to check out. Um this one kind of like silently released. And I I, I remember adding this like, putting this on like a Steam wish list. Like I what is I it, God, it would have been, like, a year and a half ago or something. And it actually came out last week. Give me one moment and I'll reveal what it is. Hang on, hang on. One second. Gotta get my windows back and just reconfigure some stuff my end. Hang on. It must be GeForce. How long have people been waiting for GeForce? Like, finally! The die-hard fan base, like, please. Please, for the love of God. Give me two minutes, sir. 
That, that was a good time. Uh, get a drink or something if you want to, because I'm going to be like a moment or two just setting this up. Hang on, hang on, hang on. He's gone. Oh, I'm still here. Hang on, hang on, hang on. It will take me a minute. Oh, you can tell I'm a professional streamer when I... <laughs> I've forgotten to install the game. Not even install it. I haven't even purchased it yet. <laughs> Professional streamer. Hang on. Okay, this is going to take a moment or two to set up, but I, I, I absolutely think this is worth the wait. I'm very excited to try it. Uh, I'm, of course, talking about... Trombone Champ, the trombone-based rhythm game that's finally made its way on Steam. I'm so excited for this game, and I cannot wait to play it. I forgot, I completely forgot this was releasing, and I really want to check it out on today's stream, because I'm not going to be able to play until later this weekend. I'll probably play it on the weekend, honestly. I might play it again on Sunday. I'm, I, I don't know why, I, something about this game, I'm just excited. Okay, it's, it's downloading. It'll be like two minutes. Update that there. Hey Archive viewers, are you guys excited for Trombone Rhythm Game? <laughs> it's like, it's real? A lot of people probably have not heard of this game. But I, I, I for what, I, I just can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah, let me see. Outer Wilds DLC? This, no, this, <laughs> this isn't that. I'm probably going to play that in my off time. I'm going to play that in my off time, I think. Jesus Christ, free float. Thank you for the 20 gift subs. We're just setting up. Thank you very much. It's unbelievably kind of you. I can hear the trombone already. That's how you know. Oh, that's how you know you're going to have a good time. Okay. Uh, do I need a controller for this game? It might help. No, we'll go, we'll go mouse and keyboard. Okay, start a new game. It's the hit. It's the new timeless classic you've all been waiting for. And so it comes Wait, what? Pass. Ages after the twin vessels were forged, a new soul appears. Brave soul. One day, you will stand before two baboons. This happened. One day, you will rend the very fabric that binds this land. I don't know what happened with, like, uh, the new Lord of the Rings Amazon but series. Until that day comes, you must toot. Peter toot Jackson really let own himself own go. Brave soul. They couldn't recover after the Hobbit trilogy. No. The trombone champ. <laughs> Welcome to Trombone Champ. Choose to play to play the main game. Afterwards, many secrets await thee. And Yeah, let's just update the stream title there. There we go. Okay, play. I'm ready. Choose your trombone. <laughs> That's not a good term. <laughs> Got Appaloosa, Beezerly, Kaizel the Second, or Trixie Bell. 
We're gonna go Kaizo. For all, <laughs> the day where all of them deceived for a better trombone was made. Yeah, I'm ready. A world of music awaits you. Press a start with a warm up. Okay, audio level is okay. This is a music game. This is a rhythm game. We want to make sure this is right. <laughs> like if you're a true tromboner. No, please don't use tromboner as a term. Trombonia! Get that hashtag going. Warm up. Move the mouse forward and back to, uh, to, uh, to move the slide. Line up the dot with the note lines. Press the left mouse or any uh, letter key to two. Using the keyboard may be easier on your wrist. Play well, you build combos and increase your chant meter. That's how you get big points. Watch the Brett meter. If you hold note for too long, you'll run out of Brett. Most of all, have fun and enjoy the beautiful, succulent music you will soon create. Let's go. Yeah, this is just the warm up. There's lyrics? <laughs> it wasn't that I had no time. Sing along. actually kind of okay. Oh, no. No, wait, no, it's a step. Got a B. I thought I just got an F. That's incredible. Earned 297 toots. <laughs> Our trombone is warmed up. It's track select. What ones have we got? Oh, there's a lot of songs here. What do we want to start with? What's the most difficult one? Trombone Fur Furte. Our sad attempt at composing a meringue song? A fast-paced Latin American dance originating in the Dominican Republic. Okay, that's nine stars. Is there a ten-star one? We gotta start in the deep end. a lot of songs. I think that's the main one we have unlocked right now. Okay, let's try it. Going in the deep end. There are between two and four spiders living inside the average truck. That's a depressing fact. Oh my... Okay, this is a little too quick. Just hold the note. Yo, he's exhausted. Hold the note. You can kind of hear the song if I do it this way. <laughs> oh my god. 
How are you supposed to do this with my No, I need, I need a controller. I need a controller. Where's my controller? You can set up proper. I'll take a seat. I'll take a seat. That's not as, that's not as bad as it could have been. There's my USB cables. Yeah. I'll be back in two minutes. I got. I'm here. I'm here. Okay. I'm not dead. I, I desperately need a controller for this. This feels impossible. Does it even work with a controller? Hope it does. Put on my headset again. Oh, no, so th with a controller, this just lets me move the mouse cursor. I don't know if this game is optimized at all. Let's try O Canada. Hang on. First trombone was invented in. I, I don't think that's true. Oh, it's harder with a controller. <laughs> it's actually unbelievably hard as far as rhythm games go. Holy shit. With these inputs, it goes so fast. You know those people who just like they only play Osu and like like that's it. This may be a game for them. Holy shit, it's so fast. The moving right to left, because I have to look at where the dot is the entire time. You don't even have the advantage of like you do in Guitar Hero where the notes are in front of you. You you can't look at them. You can't even look at them. Beethoven's fifth, yeah, this this seems like a good one. Place all the, the trombones on earth end to end, they would wrap around the solar system four times. How many trombones are there? Um no. You can kind of hear it. Oh, my God. Stop. 
Oh no! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Only a hundred and eighty six nasties. Shaking my head, streamer can't even play a two hundred year old song. <laughs> I'm not fucking Beethoven. What what can I unlock with all my coins? Can I get uh, there's so many locked features. What can I get? Quit the day like you might want to get out of here. They put that very central. Collect all 50 tromboner cards. Give me a sack. This game of- oh. Click the sack. Who's in here? We got a... Trazam? A Glissando? <laughs> Max <laughs> And Dick Slide Hide. Okay, alright. I don't know if those are rare or not. You can turn a card. I... Oh no, this has like a hardstone dust system. Why the fuck is this even in the game? So you can build it for your dust cost or you can disenchant a card to get more. Oh no, okay. We gotta save up our packs. Explore the forgotten chamber that houses the treble clef toot vessel. Okay. Hello? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? I don't know what to do. Okay. I think I think that's lore we don't quite understand yet. I would love to unlock more features. We've only got the trombone. There's so like so much is locked. How do I get enough for these? There's not even a lot of tracks. I was hoping for a few more. Do I need to get more of the cards? That just looks like a trombone. Yeah, let's try it. This, this is one star difficulty. There are more trombones on Earth than there are humans. Okay. Play baboons. Okay, I'll try baboons next. Oh no. <laughs> I know what this is now. You just get some time to think about what you're doing. Go get a drink, you know? You got a few minutes. Use the bathroom.
I mean, that's probably the best song in the game. That's probably the best one. Had to improve on perfection. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That was incredible. Okay, what, what's baboons then? Wait, no, no, I clicked on that. Oh, click on the song. Okay. It's just baboons. It's made in 2021. There's not much of a ranking for this. Tears, Spunk, Dudes, Slides, Fury. I is no playable on the trombone, so I pitched only certain species of bats can hear it. Oh, I see what's going on there. I feel like there is no control scheme that would let you play this game in a satisfying way. I'm so bad with the mouse on it. No. This looks so fun from the trailer. <laughs> it's so hard. I didn't think it would be this difficult. Just wail. <laughs> it's just tired come the end. The trombone is really difficult to play, apparently. That, that, that's what I'm learning from this game. Am I getting new songs? I think I might be. Oh, it's scroll speed! We can try it. I'm still waiting for a 10 star one. We can try gladiators. Entry of the gladiators. We'll do that with a slower scroll speed and we'll see if that helps. We're back in for most trombones. I, I think it's time to read it. Let's try this. Oh no! God! <laughs> it's just cheese here! I, what did that flag say? So hard, you have to have a laser focus. <laughs> it said ban to use the circus animals. Oh, okay, all right. That's a that's a bass trombone. <laughs> 
Jesus Christ. Star Spangled. Skip to my loot. I want to see a 10 star one. I really want to. We can get a ball game in. Takes over 3,000 hours. 3,000 tons of brass to produce a single trombone. Classic for the baseball fans. It's just like being back at your eight year old music recital. This is with the slowest scroll speed, and I'm still struggling. We out with the crowd. I've never, I've never heard the lyrics of this. I think I've only seen this in movies, like briefly. This town's kind of drunk today. Pretty good, pretty good. We got a lot of toots for our trading card collection. What one we feeling? Uh, can, wait, uh, let me let me redeem some of the cards. Can I get another trombone? Everything is locked. I can afford three sacks. Okay, we're going all in. I've already got a dick slide hide. Fuck! Is there gonna be like a legendary one? I decide. Okay. Yeah, I, 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 ha I have one of these. Well, two of these. Let's turn one into thirds. And yeah, I've already got, I've already got a back. Okay, we can, we've almost got enough to build a new card. Save up. Cl keep clicking the... Trazon card? Wait, what? What the fuck is happening? It's a cyclone. What does this mean? You need keys. How do I get the keys? I I'm just trying to play the trombone. Click on the treble clef. There can be no light without dark. No, that one's not doing anything. On oh, one copy of this card. Apparently this one's quite rare then. Yeah, this seems to be like the hollow. Compare oh, no, they're all hollow. They're all hollow. I must need to get more trading cards. 
Yeah, we're going back with Kaisile. Okay, you're actually- you're up, Trixie. Come on. 100% speed. Ein Klein. In real life, there are over nine songs that feature a trombone. I mean, they're not wrong. They're not wrong. Well, this is actually quite... <laughs> Didn't expect the remix. This is the hardest game I've ever played. Holy shit! The Dark Souls of Rhythm Games. Yeah. The Dark Souls of Trombones. You can set it so the mouse is an invert. Oh, that would be amazing. That would be amazing. I need to do that. How do I change that? This is actually the hardest game I think I've ever played. <laughs> Holy shit, it's so hard. And not invert it. I do appreciate like the Smash Bros for like Wii U and 3DS style menu here they have as well. I still don't know what's going on here. If I complete Baboon on, like, a high level, maybe they'll unlock something. Click the candle on the collect screen. <laughs> Greetings, noble tromboner. Thank you for summoning me. My name is well. Maybe some things are best kept secret for now. I'll assume you summoned me on purpose and weren't just mindlessly clicking the chaos candle. What say you, noble tromboner? You seek to become the trombone? Sure. Yeah. The boons will show you the way. To help you become the trombone champ, but I need magic to do so. My magic requires sacrificing tromboner cards. Okay. Currently require one Caravizi, one Trazam, and one Ruddy. Can you give me these cards? I, I, I want to keep that one though. He's got a secret. Okay, so I, I need to collect like the trio of cards. I only have one of them at the moment. I can afford a new sack though. Blue eyes, white baboon. <laughs> One of the most powerful Trombona cards, the Blue-Eyes White Baboon is the representation of the treble cleft as it relates to Babi, the Egyptian de de deification of the sacred Old World Habadryas Baboon.
Uh, Gluck was one of the first to introduce trombone to ballet and opera, beginning with Don Juan. Uh, this may have later influenced Mozart to use the trombone in his compositions. You could eat 30 hot dogs in one sitting. Quite impressive. That's Jack Teagarden. Al Gray, that's one of the ones he wanted, wasn't it? Do I have him? No. No, he changes them. He changes them. He wants the Shazam card. He wants the Shazam card no matter what it seems. No, they're the same. Oh, okay, right, sorry. I'm, I'm dumb. It's kinda, it's kinda hard to tell. Sugar Plum Fairy. Takes 1,000 workers a full year to produce a single trombone. Here we go. Oh no. I got used to the inverted controls. Muscle memory. Back to it. The ranks aren't bad, but we still really suck. We still really suck. I think we need an S rank and something to actually unlock. I didn't know Tchaikovsky did jazz. <laughs> Talented man. Okay, we'll try to do every song that's available. Trombone is related to the trumpet. They are cousins. <laughs> no, I actually did always think that.
Okay, that was actually a pretty good song. <laughs> that was pretty good. I got an A on that. That was actually really good. Oh, come on. Okay. I'm gonna retry it. Come on. It's fresh in my head. Here we go. I think I did this good, but... We did our best. <laughs> That's a really good one. <laughs> Number one trombone <laughs> stream on Twitch. That's a fun one. That's actually really fun. Surprisingly. <laughs> I think it worse the second time round. There's still no 10 star one. We do have the Star Spangled Banner. William Tell. Blue Danube. Stars and Stripes. Scabbard. Is there a th 10 star? There's still no 10 star. We're unlocking more songs, so. They kind of just throw them in. In England, trombone is spelled trombone. Of course. Jesus Christ, it's so damn so fast. Is this physically possible in real life to play the trombone this quick? I don't think it is. 
Name one person who's done it. I don't think he can. Jesus <laughs> It's the right to left input. It makes it so hard. It's so hard to read what's in front of you. It's fucking guitar here, but there's like 16 different notes you need. You can't see him. Turn your screen 90 degrees. I think that would help. I actually think that would help. I actually kind of want to try that. I don't want to try. I don't think I can, unfortunately, with my stream set up here. Uh, I reckon that would actually make, help you perform better. If you just could flip your screen upright. Could you sing along to one of these songs too, please? I don't have time to mentally process what's happening. It's so damn fast. It's so quick. Okay, get some stars and stripes in. A classic! After a 1987 act of the US Congress, this became the official national march of the United States of America. Wait, 1987? That feels a bit late. Surely it wasn't that recent. Bite of 87? Oh no! I could, I could down the scroll speed. I could down the scroll speed. Okay, we'll do it. You want to be a faithful for this one. Some claim that Moses' last words before dying were, at least I got to use a trombone. Sounds about right. Okay, any Americans in Twitch chat, you got to stand up for this one. Wanna see you all marching? Oh my... Why is this one impossible? The fucking vertical drops. <laughs> you can't get that. You can't. Oh no! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> oh please God, stop the pain! <laughs> no! Just wail! Fucking 
What? I can't get to the other end in time! The swings! God damn it, America! <laughs> I'll stand if you could play it perfect. I'm amazed I gotta be. I'm amazed I gotta be. Okay, let's get this one in. A student's trombone generally costs between 100 and 300 dollars, but a professional trombone can cost over 2 billion dollars. This is, okay, this is way more magical. Some songs just like shouldn't be in this game with their no setups. They just don't work. But some are okay. And they're actually quite fun. That one worked quite well. That one worked quite well. That was actually quite good. <laughs> the best one is still the anime one. Kind of had that. Uh, I don't. I don't know what exactly it was, but that was the best one by far. Can we do the sky one again? That, that was the best one. This day, scientists don't really know how a trombone makes a sound. Gotta try them all. Oh, goodness, this! Inputs that completely swap directions after going one way that really get me. I play the trombone, but I played the clarinet back in the day. Uh, I was not very good at it. I was not very good. <laughs> have we played every song? No, we unlocked a few more. Still have a few more. I thought I did Star Spangled. I feel like I have to do these on 60% scroll speed or it's way too much. Get some trading cards. Oh. 
Can afford five sacks. Sweet, a Tchaikovsky. That's just a hot dog. But it's been around since 1421, apparently. Okay. <laughs> Music itself. That's another hot dog. Alright. There's a Mozart. That's a good one. Did I get the ones the demon wants? Oh, we still need a Polidoro. We're almost there. We just need one more. If I can, if I um, turd my hot dog, I might be able to get enough to craft one. Fantastic commentary on Hearthstone here in the stick once we cover that game. It makes me sad. I used to love it so much. I heard those ones. Try Trozab again. I, I I could give it a go. Yeah, we're 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 we're, we're turned in some cards here, so we can maybe craft the ones that we need. I kind of want to know what's going on with this game. I don't. I didn't expect like all this secret stuff. I I don't understand what I need to do. We have a few blue eyes, but we might need three of them. We might need three. Uh, this one has a satanic circle on it. Let's craft it. <laughs> Jesus. It's the one we need. Perfect. Let's give him his carrots. Excellent, you sure about this? I am gonna lose Trezam though. I, I can craft another Trezam. I can craft another tre Trezam. I should perform my magics immediately. What is happening? Go quick. Gotta go quick. Come on. Congrats. You played the video game a lot and unlocked a thing. A silver trombone. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. There's a new satanic circle here. Let's build it. Gustav Maller. Okay, what does he want now? Uh, I, I can get another reward. Do so you combine your cards for unlocks? Oh, if I gotta click the box again. Actually, take a while. You really gotta work for it. The red trombone. There's more satanic circles. 
I, I imagine the satanic circles are the cards he's gonna be after for an unlock. I do need my boy Trazam back. I do need my boy back. Here's my rarest card. Power play in my deck. You know, I, we, we gotta keep him handy. And we can just build this mystery one. Okay, it's pretty good. Pretty good. I, I have, can we do anything on this critical section of the game yet? This game is only new. I, 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 I have to wait till like a wiki is established or something. Get four S ranks. Oh no, you might be right. You might be right. Click the base clef card, it's jumping. Was it? This just takes me back here. It's closer now? The light is red. <laughs> There's gonna be a game theory about this. Absolutely, and it's gonna be like, 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 like the untold horrors of Trombone Champ. I'll be the guy with the trombone, but like, the what? Like, there's no pupils in his eyes, and it's like he's crying blood for some reason. Absolutely, gonna uh, it's gonna exist in like a week. Absolutely. So if I get an S rank, will that unlock one of them? I could do- I could try the one I'm good at again. I could try it. Gotta do Sky again till we get S. It's the best- it's the best song. By far. Where is it? No, it's, There it is. Have I- did I do it on 100% before? I think I did. Oh, I gotta use the new trombone as well. I gotta use my new trombone. Hang on. I'm gonna go with red. Professional trombone player is known as the tromboner. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Meter do? Don't have time to reach out at all. I don't know why I even asked that.
Fine, again the double bits. Perfect. That's probably not an S. But I think that's the highest we've gotten. I think we're very close on this. Oh, damn it. It's a new personal best. This song is going on my sex playlist. <laughs> Why? Why would you share that? <laughs> we didn't need to know. We didn't need to know. <laughs> Okay, we gotta play it again. We gotta get an S rank. You've a true tromboner in chat. Come on, that's gotta be enough! <laughs> there we go! <laughs> that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'll take that. Jesus Christ. Okay, is that unlocked ending with the baboons? Time to check in on him. It's- it's unlocked one of the locks. I need three more to get it. Oh no. Okay, uh, the warm-up one we can probably cheat. Let's get our silver trombone. Thirty-four countries have outlawed the use of trombone. In six countries, playing trombone is punishable by death. Here we go.
longest combo we've ever achieved. Look at that. We blew it off the screen. <laughs> yeah, we just need, we need two more perfects. Two more perfects. That's two S ranks. What other one do we think we could get it in? If we really went for it. I mean, th this one is a one star difficulty. Okay. Wait, what? Okay, this one should be pretty straightforward. Fucking pause. So long. <laughs> I feel like it gets longer. I feel like they're just fucking with you. Okay, that's another, that's gotta be an S. There you go. Okay, we need one more S. What's another S tier we could achieve? There are some new ones. Have we got an A in anything? No, th th those are all the ones we got an A in. Baboons was really hard, I thought. It's the lowest difficulty. Oh no, I don't. I don't particularly want to sing that one. I don't particularly want to. I think we have a choice though, alright. Well, trombones there would never have been a ska music. Draw your own conclusions from this factoid. Wait, what? What's ska? Oh no. It's possible to get a mod. Just remove this from the song list for me, please. At least it's easy. Picked beans. <laughs> of course, it's important. Okay, that's that's our four S's, so that should hopefully be enough. We can unlock the baboon secret. What what has that done? Oh, Jesus! <laughs> I was down the one who had been a knocking on my little hatch. Yes. Ah, thou art truthful. That is good. 
Is the knocker not what hatches are for after all? Is the trombone champ? Is it thine wish to become the champ? Yeah. It's great. Good news. Allow it me to introduce myself. I am the primordial baboon Toot Seeker Tom. I th I'll be honest, like, Trombone Champ is not the video game that I thought was going to be, like, a, a running commentary on, like, the video games at large and, like, just referencing fucking everything. <laughs> it actually is Dark Souls now. Allow me to show you something. He start eyes upon the toot vessel. What is this? What is it for? Has this affect my life personally? These are questions which I've long since forgotten the answers. My bad. I do recall it. The toot vessel requires toots. Feed it toot and the cleft shall awaken. That's why it's called the toot vessel, you see. It's literally a vessel for toots. Anyway, hold the vessel with toots so that the treble cleft may awaken. Sure. Can't wait for this to turn to open world action adventure game. Honestly, it could. It could. The Toot Vessel Awakens. Oh, here we go. You gotta work for every loot box. Character Polygon? Sure. Chest of treasure, pop it out. Fascinating. However, I feel there's more hidden within that vessel. So I am certain that the toot vessel can be un can be further awakened. Fill the vessel with toots so that the treble clef may awaken. Don't have enough toots. Does that mean I can, if I unlock the other one via the trading card? Hang on. Because the base clef was jumping at us. Oh, Jesus. Hello there. Don't want to discover me. My name is Base Master Ben. Oh, so this, this, we can get the alternate ending. Of course, this is the more hidden route. If you wish, I will now share the tr full truth of the trombone champ. It's a wordy of the trombone champ. Well, let's get started. In ancient days, the first lords created music. At that time, things were in harmony. The natural discordance began to arise within the music. There were those who sought to destroy the harmony. Reach a positive note, there was a negative. As we get treble, Mozart began, began Trezon. Does this story bore you? Would you like me to stop? No, keep going, please. Good, because there's a lot more of this. This is going to go on for a while. Anyway, the forces of order split music into two. The treble and the bass. Thus, there is, the, things have stood for ages, but it is not the true way. Fabi, the first true lord, created artifacts which would allow one to control the nature of music. With these artifacts and using proper technique, one could change the very nature of music itself. But of course, there were those who would abuse this power, and so it had to be kept secret. But of course, the seal of order is held fast by that miserable doppelganger, Trezam. I would not stop you. Would you like me to not stop? Continue. Would you not to stop? Stop and stop in the story. Don't stop the story, please. Oh, don't... Oh, fuck. Um... Not yes. Okay, to seal the power, Babby created two vessels, the tooth vessel and the third vessel. Each vessel was guarded by one of Babby's children. Most likely you've already met one. Bootmaster Tom guards the tooth vessel, which symbolizes treble. The power it contains. The high base master Ben guard the third vessel, which symbolizes base and the power it contains. And a true champion who fully awakens both vessels may restore music to what it once was. A free power without order. This champion is known as the trombone champ, for this weapon shall be the trombone. Bobby's favorite instrument. Repeat that for dramatic effect. The trombone champ! Though this trombone champ will need to defeat the forces of the order which require what the vessels grant. Additionally, this champ will need to f fully ally themselves with B Babby and increase their power. Forces of order have a power level of 10. We can assume that the trombone champ would require the same, if not more. Okay, this, this is just gonna keep on going a while. Not start from the beginning or not. Please don't start from the beginning.
Gave you the abridged version after all. Taught you everything you need to know, and now continue your quest to become the trombone champ. Fill the vessel with turrets so that the base cleft may awaken. 